Okay, let's talk about the, the first pair of words. What is words. it? These are <laughs> mm -hmm. very interesting. 공유하다. 공유하다. And 나누다. 나누다. These were also, uh, this was also a requested pair of words. So yeah. 공유하다 and 나누다. What is the common translation, Adrian? To share. To share, yes. 공유하다. 공유하다. So you can, um, let's say you're using um, social media, mm -hmm. you can share a photo. Kongyu. That's, that's right. Kongyu hada. Yeah. So uh, apparently, of course, obviously, kongyu hada and nanuda, although they both mean sh to share, mm -hmm. they have different usages. Yeah. So nanuda? Sharing a photo, kongyu is possible. Yeah. Nanuda. Nanuda. Nanuda is more like you have to divide mm -hmm. food. Yeah. Or you have to split something maybe physically. That's a good point. Nanuda. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's the point that I wanted to. Is that it? Actually, yeah, like bring up because nanuda means to share. To share. But at the same time, to divide. To divide. So think of a cake that you have to uh -huh. eat. You, you know? can't say kongyuhada. No. Cake, kongyuhada. <laughs> or you can kongyu the sajin, the mm -hmm. photo of that cake, mm -hmm. but you can't really. Kong you the cake. Yeah, so not in every single case, but in many cases, Kong you hada can be used about things that can be shared mm -hmm. and still kept. Whereas nanuda can be shared and therefore divided and therefore consumed and mm. therefore, you know, just gone. Nanuda. nanuda. Can you give us some examples? For so, me? for example, if you say sajinul nanuda, uh -huh. it can be a stack of 20 photos. Okay. And then you take 10. I, I take, take 10. 10. Mm -hmm. That's nanuda. Nanuda. Kungyu Divide. Yeah, kungyuhada would be more like we share the photo files mm -hmm. so that you can have the 20 photos, I can have the 20 photos. As well. As well. Like uh -huh. we have many, many different yeah. copies of the photos. So nanuda is more like you split. Split. Exactly. You split or you divide. Mm -hmm. And there are also uh, some different usages. For example, you can say iagiru nanuda. Uh -huh. Exchanging stories. I see. But you never say, Iyagiru kongyuhada. No. Yeah. That's a bit strange. You can only, probably Nanuda. only use it on social media. Kongyu. Yeah. Is there, um, kongyu. Mm. Do you use this verb? Um, can you give us maybe another example? Not photos, not social media. Mm -hmm. Kongyuhada. Kongyuhada, well... Like, hmm. it's, it's a very formal sounding word, of course. Kongyuhada. And these days, a lot of services, they offer people uh, some things that they can share. Yeah. So, car share services, office ah. share services. In those business type contexts, mm -hmm. people often say kongyuhada. Kongyuhada. Konganel kongyuhada. So you can like share a location, a place. Space. A space. Yes. Yeah. Or yeah. you, you open up and you share the car or mm -hmm. it's a car share service. But you can't really nanuda it again, it's like you you know, you had for example, it's as if you had like ten cars mm -hmm. and you give two cars <laughs> to one person, three cars to another person yeah. and the other five cars to another person. So so nanuda is to share mm -hmm. but with the the idea of dividing or mm. splitting something. Splitting and each member of the group taking a portion. Yeah. yeah. Very good. So that was the first pair of words mm -hmm. um, requested by one of our listeners. Yes. Kongyuhada and Nanuda. Thank you for the request. Yeah. If you also have words that you want us to clarify for you because the definition you found online is the same mm -hmm. for both words, but you don't know when to use this one, when to use that one, mm -hmm. send us your messages and we'll uh, take care of that. 